I did notice I was getting a little bit more nervous as a traveller um, on recent flights I've taken. In your 20s, you don't care, do you? Like that, I'll live forever. I'll live forever, me. I'm going to live forever. As you get older, you start to really pay attention to the, uh, to the safety announcements on planes. <laughs> it becomes more urgent. You're more aware of your own mortality. You know, they'll start the announcement. I will definitely pay attention, absolutely pay attention. The glasses go on, the headphones come off. Book goes down, notebook comes up. Right now. <laughs> Last flight I was on, it got to that point, we've all heard it a thousand times. We've all heard it a thousand times. They put the little life jacket on, right? They put the little life jacket on, and she went, she said, uh, and of course, in the event of landing on water, there is a whistle to attract attention. In the event of landing on water, there is a whistle. A whistle to attract attention. Now, I think for the first time in my life, I really took in that whistle. <laughs> the fabric of that whistle, if you will, the, the being of that whistle, the ergonomics of that whistle. There is a whistle to attract attention. My brain had the very helpful thought. It thought, well, if we have landed on water, we have essentially fallen out of the sky from 30 to 40,000 feet <laughs> in a not insignificant metal tube that may or may not be on fire. If that hasn't attracted attention... <laughs> if everybody in the surrounding area has managed not to notice... <laughs> and you are then reliant on... <laughs> I got this. <laughs>